fashion means everything. Fashion means life. It's everything is a way of life. The way we do things, the way we do society. Um, fashion is just everything to me. I mean, without fashion on earth, I don't know what the world would be like. Fashion is art. It's a language you want to speak. So, what are you speaking? Are you speaking modesty? Are you telling somebody you're classy? Are you telling somebody you're, you're wild? Are you telling somebody you're simple? You know, for me, it's just an expression. Um, yeah, so fashion for me is an expression. Get into your comfort zone, whatever it is. Um, you want to, you know, speak out or tell people this is who I am. Like for me, I am very simple. I don't do loads of loud colors. So for me, it for me, fashion is less is more. Simple and straightforward. That's me. The Nigerian retail fashion industry is one that has evolved significantly over the years, moving gradually from traditional to more modern systems, from buying to selling at open air markets. I would say retailing fashion items in Nigeria, I would say it's quite an interesting one. Challenging and very competitive uh, because you'd see, I mean, down this road, you find out there are more than 20 stores selling fashion items and so there's so many people doing the same kind of things you're doing and you want to stand out you know you have people who are offering you want to like what we do we sell dresses and tops and pants and you find that other people are actually also selling these kind of things sometimes less quality so at the end of the day you find out that you want to offer quality at good prices and also beat competition. It, I would say that it's a challenging one. However, if you have a passion for it, it's very interesting. For the past five years, uh, people got to know about um, ready to wear outfit. I mean, it's been great, it's been going very well. People actually love African design. They actually want to even do more of African design than, I mean, than the foreign outfits. People really appreciate African design a lot. They're really very happy about what we make. Online shopping is a form of electronic commerce which allows consumers to directly buy goods or services from a seller over the internet using a web browser. Online shopping is amazing. I think it's um, that made things a lot easier, really. Um, from products to services, you know, it's brought everything closer to the consumer or the customer, and. Um, like in my own area, in my own field, makeup, people just sit online and some people don't wait to, you know, have a trial or two. They just check you up on, in, on online and it's easier than it's easier for them to judge you based on all the works you have done. So for me, I think it's it's more like it has satisfied people's works and products more like and made people feel, you know, I can do this thing online instead of having to go to the shop or leave my office to go do something or to go buy something so for me it's i think it's 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 it has done a lot for customers and consumers basically and i think it's an amazing development to me that's the next um phase of fashion in nigeria retailing fashion items in nigeria um everybody wants to be on the co everybody you know have smartphones you know and you 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 want to at the convenience of your home or your office or in the car you want to do things so i believe that online shopping really is the next phase of business however the industry that's where um, everywhere is, everyone is going Online shopping of fashion items offers benefits to both the customers and the retailers. Yeah, it offers benefits, first of all, to, I would say, to both parties, to the retailer and to the one who is purchasing. Number one, it offers, for us who, is, who are retailing, you have um, less overhead. You, you know, it's a virtual shop. You're not, um, you don't have all the overheads that you have when you have a physical store you know, all the overheads of salaries, of rent and what have you. And then you can reach out, you have a wider reach. Everyone, virtually everyone 
in the world can actually access your goods. So you're not limited to space. For instance, I'm here in Towing Street, Ikeja. If I didn't have an online store, no one would be able to see what I have. However, if I have an online store, you can be in New York and see what I'm selling here. So definitely it offers you that reach. And then for the one who is purchasing, it offers you convenience, I would say. Challenges in fashion, I would say, number one is the competition. And number two, fashion is, is dynamic, you know, fashion is always evolving. So you have the risk of obsolescence. you have the risk of, you know, you have goods that you just purchased probably two months ago and now no one wants to buy that style. Now they want the new thing. And so that's one of the challenges we're facing in fashion. So, you know, and then the competition, like I said, everybody's, everybody wants to, I mean, fashion, everyone loves fashion. So if you want to go by passion, probably everybody has that passion, I believe. So the competition is um, is enormous for us. The competition out there is actually not very easy because right now so many people are opening fashion houses. You can, I can tell you in Mecca they have over 100 fashion houses right now. Other places they have so many, you go to Nigeria, they have so many. The competition is actually very, very high. And when people find out, what people do is that most of the senior designs, they go to a cheaper place, they go to the places. You know, you make something new, you try to display it, you try to put it on, you even try to like advertise the product. Before you know it, people just go and make somewhere else cheaper. So sometimes, you know, but we still base on our very good clients.